Hi, my name is Tywin Ko. I'm from Hutchinson, Kansas. Hi, my name is Justin Curry. I'm from Olathe, Kansas. The reason why we're doing this um, solar lantern is so that we can replace uh, kerosene lamp, which is, is so widely used in rural areas such as Africa and India. Um, solar lantern is a lot cleaner, safer, and much more efficient. Um, there are three major components to a solar lantern system. One, you have the solar panel, which draws in power from the sun and then converts it into electricity. And that electricity uh, charges the rechargeable battery, which uh, puts out constant current to the LEDs. Um, a typical solar lantern uses a fluorescent tube, like, kind of like this. But for our research, we're using uh, light main diodes, which is short for LEDs. And compared to fluorescent tube, it only draws in from one to two watts of power and can last more than six years. So here's the fluorescent light. And here's the LED light. And as you can see, LED is smaller, better, and much more efficient. All right, these are the reflectors in the lantern, and basically what we're going to do with these is put foil over the top of them, reflecting foil, kind of like a mirror, so that when they're in, the light can basically reflect off. The reason I have it cone-shaped is so the light can cover a larger radius. Uh, I decided to do research because I knew it would benefit me in numerous ways, such as it would um, open the door for more internships in the future. Also, it would allow, to, allow me to make a smooth transition from high school to college. I would know a little bit more material than the other engineers that are coming in. Support that, to just make it fit. Oh, see. Yeah. I, I feel really fortunate to be in this program because it really gave me a lot of knowledge on uh, uh, renewable energy and sustainability and then um, it really gave me a head start.